Hey guys, welcome to my very first video for my channel. Um, and today we're going to be looking into how to replace the battery on this Razer motorcycle. Um, so, first you have to take off the plastic and stuff. And if you want, I can create another video on that. Um, just let me know in the comments. Um, we had to take, first thing after you get the plastic and stuff off is you've got to take the metal bar holding the batteries in off. And we had to force this out with the screwdriver so we could pull the batteries out. Um, next, we're going to be looking into how to um, fix the batteries because um, the batteries we bought just came with, you know, the batteries. They didn't come with the wire. Okay, um, so here we have the old battery that we brought out of the motorcycle. As you can see that um, it's not one big battery, it's it's two batteries. And we have the new battery that we just bought, uh, the 12 volt 7AH battery. Um, the wires on the old one were soldered on, so now we're going to have to cut them and move them onto the newer batteries. Um, so the tools we have are the wire cutters, and the wire strippers. Uh, the wire strippers are going to be used to expose the wire and we wanted we want to save as much of the wire as we can and then we bought these female disconnect um, things so we can put the wires on there and they will they will just attach right onto the battery. Um, so let's get started. Um, before we start you might want to take a picture because the wires are really specific on how it's supposed to be. So go ahead and do that. Um, now before you cut, you want to save as much of the wire as you can. So you want to get up closer to the wire, closer to the tip. Then you can just cut it right off. And then there's going to be a little like, rubber thing on that you're going to want to pull off. Um, and then just do that through all the batteries. Um, some it's going to be harder to, to get close down to the wire. So just go ahead and try. Okay, so now you're going to take the wire and you're going to use the stripper to strip enough of it so that you can put the connector disconnect on. Um, I probably need to take a little bit more off this or it won't go correctly into the disconnect. So I'll go ahead and do that. Whoops. Um, make sure you twist the wire so it's easier going on in. I'll do that really quick. You can just go ahead and use your fingers for that. Um, after that, just plug it right into the disconnect. But now you're going to have to squeeze the heck out of it. And once you squeeze that on, it's good to be plugged in. Should be good. And then go ahead and do the next part of the wire. Okay, so we'll just go ahead and strip this off now. Um, twist the wire. and go ahead and get the next disconnect. 
that'll be plugged right in. Then clamp it on. And that one should be good. And now that this is done, you can go ahead and plug it in. Make sure you put it in correctly. You might have to wiggle that on. That should be good. Let's get this old battery out of the way. Okay, and now we'll do the next wire. We'll start with the red one. Twist the wire. Okay, and then get ready for that next disconnect to put on. Okay. Now that one's good. We'll move on to the black one now. Twist it. <clears throat> and get the next disconnect. Squeeze that last one on real tight. And that's it for those. Um, and then just put them on correctly. And that's it for the batteries. Thanks. Now we're gonna glue the batteries together just like the old ones, so it's better. Uh, just go ahead, turn it on its side, so it's easier to glue. Now you're gonna take the hot glue gun, Just like that. Push on it, make sure it's secure. Then just go ahead and let it dry for a second. 
Next, I'll be showing you how to put it back into the motorcycle. Okay. Okay. Now, just go ahead and slip the battery right in. Careful not to tangle up the wires and stuff. Find the connector that it's going to connect into and just slide it in. And that's just about it. Um, besides taking off the plastics and stuff, which, like I said earlier, um, if you need me to show you how to do that, just write in the comments that you need help with that, and I can show you with that. Um, anyways, thanks for watching, guys. That's it.